The Weekly Producer Showcase, starring G Life, slash 24 Hour Verse Challenge, featuring a new Beat Stars producer every week. Little G, Big Wife. It's my last hat. That's why it's all crunched. Man, <clears throat> everything's falling apart for me. But I'll tell you what, I have my own home studio and I can make music here. So nothing is falling apart for me. Please ignore the noise. It's my dog chewing on a bone. She doesn't listen to anyone, not even me. And I only started recording because this is another one of our sessions where I think I'm gonna pick a beat and I'm gonna write to a, I'm gonna make a track in under 24 hours. I wanted to start recording because I'm going to surf for a beat. Because what I wanna to do today, I wanna to sit in the sun and tan a little bit while I write this song. It might even be like just writing, write, like memorizing a few keyword elements as opposed to writing it word by word. But um, either way, it's 4.25 p.m. June 18th. I'm going to be looking at, I'm probably gonna do an Eighth Life beat. Man, I really appreciate you, Eighth Life. Eighth Life uh, went through and, and watched the old G Life documentaries and really got to know, really got to know me. Before that, I was always saying team life, team life. But uh, I, you know the audience and now Eighth Life knows. We're lifers, baby, we're lifers. But Eighth Life, honorary member, lifers. And uh, again, Eighth Life and Dat Boy Butta. Today, so we're in a Beat Stars community where we do online seminars every day and just today they both had their beats reviewed by Sony A&R reps. Cheers to all the producers who have been a part of this. Cloud9 Music, Rock5, King Swisser, Gelmare Beats. Shout out to all of you. Shout out to Beat Stars. Shout out to everyone following, watching. These songs have now started hitting Spotify and Apple Music. So if you look up G Life, all one word, like Glyph, G Life, you'll find all the new songs on Spotify, Apple Music, Amazon Music, etc., etc. You can always check out all my music at georgelife.com and everywhere at George Life. So soundcloud.com, George Life, Audius, George Life. Beat Stars, georgelife.beatstars.com. I just wanted to timestamp this and uh, I'll let, I'm gonna go surf a few. Now, I wonder if I could do something to that summertime beat that Eighth Life did. This dog, dude. Usually I would kick her out while I'm recording if she's making noise, but if you've been watching these, these uh, videos about how I write these 24 hour verse challenges, they're pretty laid back videos. In the other videos, I'm not really smoking, I'm not really swearing. Um, these videos, they can be a little more chill. So, so I should introduce that then real quick also. So what this is, this is episode five of, close these down. This is episode five of my 24 hour, no wait, I call it, this is episode five of Weekly Producer Showcase, the weekly Beat Stars producer showcase no 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 the weekly producer showcase starring g life slash 24 hour verse challenge featuring a new beat stars producer every week oh i pick a song i write to it i record it i put out a little lyric video all in under 24 hours we did four already eighth life i don't know much about eighth life other than 8th Life is a very nice person who makes incredible beats and is on the Beat Stars, is part of the community big time. $9, it's, so he made a 8th Life. I, I keep stopping because I don't know about he, she, they. I don't want to disrespect anyone. I'm just trying to get out of the habit of he, she, they, or he, she. So 8th Life, 8th Life made a playlist, 50% off summer bangers. So I opened it and I'm stoked instantly. Not because 988, dude, ugh. Even though I do this every week, like, man, some weeks I don't even make 30 bucks. So for me to go and spend it on a beat, it's hard, man. So a $9 beat, whew, 
Man, lifesaver, dude. Lifesaver. Thank you, Eighth Life. See, I was just wondering if any of these were the one in the playlist. Mojito. Mojito was the one in the playlist because I was like, man, no, I need a drink. Yeah, I mean, this is so right up my alley. But maybe I mean, I need something not up my alley. Mojito. I mean, this is Margaritaville, dude. Every day I try to take a vacation in my head. That's where I go. Damn, that shit was fire. Ooh, I just got the chills. Every day I try to take a vacation in my head. That's where I go. Damn, that shit's straight up bringing tears to my eyes. Because a lot of you guys know, I'm overdoing myself. I'm overworking myself musically. Because I'm going through some things in life. So I try to take a vacation in my head every day. Ooh, if something can evoke emotion like that, I think we gotta get it. I think we gotta take it. See if I can get that chorus down before I forget it. Wow. Wow, what an amazing song, Eighth Life, you know. To be able to make something that gives someone the chills and sends them into tears within minutes of hearing it. So what an incredible gift you have. I'm embarrassed, honestly, but I, I love uh, being raw and real with the music, you know. Okay, so we're looking at our rights. Those of you that don't know Beat Stars, gosh, it's so easy, dude. It's so easy. So we're just gonna get the cheap version. Here's the other thing you can always think of. You can uh, upgrade licenses as you go. If you're like, wow, I actually need the stems, or I think I'll make an offer on the exclusive. If, if they're, they're, they're offering the track out unlimited for 50, I think, uh, I think even 150 would be a fair offer from the buyer's perspective, you know? Okay, so here's our, for $9.88, we can use it for a recording. We can do 250,000 online audio streams. We can do for profit live performances. We can distribute up to 2,000 copies. We can do two music videos, radio broadcasting rights, unlimited stations. Amazing. Okay, we're going to download the MP3 right now. So this is interesting. We were talking about in the last one how these MP3s are... They come up as a random group of numbers and letters. Now it turns out what that's all about. Here, I'll show you. I'll drag it back. Look at it over here. This is the number. It's a, you know, so what I learned today in the Twitter spaces with Sydney and Abe, uh, the founder of Beat Stars, is that the reason these MP3s come up as a random grouping of numbers and letters, apparently it would be very, it, it could be an issue if hackers were able to kind of identify file names. Something I never knew. A mojito is one of my favorite drinks and I can often make it here. Today we're gonna have to swap the rum for gin. So it'll be a gin and tonic. We'll skip the sugar, I don't do sugar. Gin and tonic, mint and lime. We'll do lemon instead. All right, fuck it, it ain't a mojito. You know, I've, I've come to find out in life, the older I got with the music, that if something's gonna happen for me musically, I gotta make it happen. I'm not gonna get the magic email. I'm, I've am i gotta go out there and make it happen. And I think this is a great way to do it. I think, I think putting out a chorus and a verse every week is a great way to do it. You know, I have five shows locked in for the tour. So I take the show on the road, I build it by hand. You know, not a big deal. Cool. So let's go make ourselves a mojito-ish drink. 
and write to this. Wow, it's gonna be cool. I gotta put out the Twitter post, right? It's official, let's go make this mojito and then we'll post that to Twitter as well. Every day I gotta take a vacation in my head. That's where I go. Okay, he switched it up. Oh man, how tropical. Oh no, this is such a happy song. I don't think we should make it too sad. You know? It's a happy vacation in my head. Every day I take a vacation. In my head. That's where I go. All I ever needed was one marijuana smoke. And a tall mojito. Should I do something like that? <laughs> Ooh, I don't know about that one. Vacation. I don't know, I kind of want to do it. Fresh mint for my mojito. I for real used to drink a lot of mojitos. Half of the game is presentation. If you take your mint, probably be enough for me. Clap it supposed to help release it I tear it after that I'm sure connoisseurs would yell at me but boom look at that now nah, we're not just drinking some shit mojito man we fucking made a bomb ass mojito team life over here eighth life oh my cat pissed on it just kidding I love mint. I love a garden. You can see how I live over here. Okay, I just came up with another line. It's uh, but I think I might have to sing this whole song. I don't know if it has the right tempo to rap on. Food trucks, as far as the eyes can see, every one of them has vegetarian, has vegan options. But the best part is they all serve me for free. Something like that. So it's like this place in my head. What would be the coolest place? What would be the coolest stuff about it? If the main th thing is that like everything's free. So food trucks far as the eye can see. But they're all for free. And they all have vegan options. This will be fun. You know it's about like think about it like this. <clears throat> as a grown person how often do you get to use your imagination? Free mojitos, free weed, obviously, free marijuana. I'd have to have uh, some animals, you know, I don't know, dancing, singing, free shows. What things shouldn't cost money? I mean, I don't want to make it a sad song about like, yeah, obviously we shouldn't be paying for health care and dental care, obviously. Like, in my circles, that's not even a conversation, dude that people can go broke on health problems. So we're gonna leave that sad stuff out of it. There's hippies, they're all handing out some weed. They roll it up, they light it up, they give it to me. It's real simple. My favorite, my favorite singers get plays, my favorite rappers on stage, my favorite producers paid, my favorite we're all there with my favorite DJs. Yep. Boom. It doesn't matter how much we weigh or what we look like or how we get laid. But I was just thinking there, how much we get paid. But it, you know, that's like a LGBTQ. It doesn't matter how much. But this is, because again, this is a place in my mind, you know, where everything's perfect. So it doesn't matter. These things. That's a build up, not in a musical build up, not in a speed build up. It's a build up on an intellectual build up. Like we are in a place where money doesn't matter for just a few hours a day. What's gonna like blow your mind, you know? My favorite rapper's on stage, my favorite, and my favorite, and they're all my favorite DJs, and we're all friends, and it doesn't matter how much I weigh, or what we look like, or how we get laid, everything, you know? What else is gonna be incredible, you know? 
<laughs> you know, it's funny because you're like, well, yeah, it's got to be like mind blowing. Well, okay, if it was that fucking easy, you know, it always reminds me of Tracy Jordan or Tracy Morgan. He's when he's on 30 Rock and he's like, I'm just trying to write the greatest song of all time. How hard could it be? You know, man, we've already gotten a lot here so far because because singing is slower than rapping. We're already like uh, 12 bars. So, but we'll figure it out. We'll get it all figured out. And we're also only an hour and a half in. The song's really dope. It's so dope. But I also get that, like, a lot of the people following me along are wanting raps. I love to sing. I mean, I've talked about it before. I love Bradley Knoll, Sublime, the lead singer of Sublime who passed away. I'm friends with the DJ for Sublime, LD on the cut. He works with Neutron and uh, and also DJ Zoll. Much love to all three of y'all. But uh, so I saw Rome and Sublime, Sublime with Rome. And he was amazing too. Rome was a great singer, absolutely. Um, but I, I love a Sublime type tip. You know, I always loved gangster rap, but I also liked the people that could be hard and not in gangs, like uh, Bradley Knoll, Sublime. I mean, he's, he's singing about his my shiny silver gat and my homies got my back right it doesn't have to be that hardcore shit but he was for real about it too he lived the real deal and so do i and so do all my people you know if you're out here like look at my tour i have okay denver I mean, i'm holding my vape right here come with the denver rock springs cortez colorado salt lake logan i mean these are gun-toting fucking places you might think that they're not that dangerous and they probably aren't but you're not safe. You're not safe anywhere. Anyway, none of that's what this song is about other than it has a sublime vibe. And Sublime is one of my favorite groups. Bradley Knowles, one of my favorite singers, for sure, of all time. Look how pretty it is. You got the mint in there how we get like every day this is a place I have to go because IRL can suck this is my after show we got the 8th and the G it's all lifers I see we keep it in family it's such a great place to be so that's how it ends okay to log the time for how long it took us to do that 653 so two hours and ten minutes right like a fire ass verse like a Bradley Knoll sublime singing shit eighth life cake dude team life just killed it it's such a great place to be because the whole time I'm just talking about this place you know so uh, man I love it I really love it man it's time to eat a little bit of food we had three mojitos, we, I had three mojitos, I had three mojitos, it's time to let them wear off for a bit, eat some food, we're gonna hop in the booth, we're gonna finish, and then we're gonna get more mojitos, business before pleasure. Yo, yo, okay, actually I'm just gonna record when I'm done. Because uh, I'm going to do the lyric video, so I want to do my hair. I want to change my shirt. One more time. Let's do it. Here we go. One more time. G life. Eighth life. Every day, I gotta take a vacation Man, I need it. In, my head. In my head There's a place where I go Love that place. It's a place where I don't need no money, money. What's that? And they give me free mojitos Better than money Food trucks as far as the eyes can see all have vegan options and they're all for free. They're all free. There's 
just a bunch of hippies with a bunch of weed. They roll it up, they light it up, they give it to me. My favorite rappers on stage, my favorite singers get plays, my favorite producers pay. They're all with my favorite DJs, we're all friends. And it doesn't matter how much we weigh, or what we look like, or how we get laid every day. This is a place that I have to go. Cause IRL can suck, this is my after show We got the A and the G, it's all lifers we see We keep it in the family, it's such a great place to be Yeah. Every day, I gotta take a vacation In my head, there's a place where I go It's a place where I don't need no money I just can't say it enough. What an amazing song. What an amazing beat. Wow. 